and she's got a great smile. If you want to have a great smile, how's that for a second? <laughs> February is National Children's Dental Health Month, and it can be tough for parents when it comes to getting kids to brush their teeth consistently. Oh, so tough. But if you start young and make it fun, you can get that routine down. Emily Coleman with MrsKansasMommy.com is here with some great ideas, uh, starting with that very first toothbrush. Welcome to the show. Thank you. So when the very first tooth pops up, that's always the worst time as a mom because you're up all night. But <laughs> and they're drooling a lot. Actually, the it was a mom who's a dental hygienist who created this product. It's called the Baby Banana Brush. No need. So what's different about this than a normal baby toothbrush is it's made of food grade silicone, but it's also the design that makes it safer. Wow. Because we know like when toddlers are little, they stagger around like drunk people. <laughs> so you yeah. can actually let your baby walk around with this and not worry that they're going to impale themselves. It might become their new favorite toy, it too, might. because it's kind of cool. And you then, can and actually then put it in the freezer. Okay. And the best thing is it's dishwasher safe. Okay. So that's always much easier than having to hand wash everything. So you've got these things to get them started right. But right. once they are supposed to be brushed, how, how do you keep them brushing? How do you know they just don't, they put water on the toothbrush walk out? Well, when they're little, I mean, I do recommend supervising your right, child. Right, but when, when, they they older, <laughs> when they get older, when they get older, you know, how do you get them to brush for long enough? Well, actually, this product right here is the Magic Mud, and okay. what that does is it turns your teeth completely black. <gasps> so, I have seen this. I've been no, so curious. It was a family event <laughs> oh, when we tried it. We were what? laughing hysterically. Um, it's made from activated charcoal, so it's toxin-free, gluten-free, all of that um, fancy stuff we have to care about for our kids now. Wow. Um, you can get this at Sprouts, so okay. just pick it up next time you're at your health food store. What does it taste like? Because my kids are very, like... They want things to be strawberry flavored. Really good toothpaste. question. Um, my five year old just loved it that it turned her teeth black and wanted to brush again immediately. And my husband said he was shocked how good it actually tasted. Okay. He, he said he was really surprised. He That's was skeptical. There's cinnamon clove on there. So there's, there's yeah, it comes in three flavors cinnamon and sort of peppermint. Kind of cinnamon. And then it also has a wintergreen flavor and a uh, whitening product that you can use at night. Okay. Yeah. Do kids need? Do they need whitening? No, stuff? this is for adults. Oh, yeah. I was like, I'm I not like worried about that yet. With my kids, camera ready at all times. <laughs> Botox. It's never, too, like it's never too early. Like a concern. It's never too early to wake up. Thank you for not, clarifying. I'm not a dentist. Do <laughs> not be our, our next segment. <laughs> Botox for kids. Botox. Oh gosh, kids. no. Yeah. Oh. Well, okay. speaking of kids looking great, eating healthy. <laughs> <laughs> eating healthy is obviously a huge part of dental hygiene. And this is from Learning Resources. You can actually get it at learningresources.com. It's the new Sprouts Fresh Picked Fruit and Veggie Tote. So okay. it comes with all these little cute little fruits and this adorable little baggie. Um, my three-year-old now has a little stool in the kitchen, so she'll come over and want to cook with me all the time. And this is like the perfect little set for your little mini sushi. And kids love these. They do end up everywhere. They do. And then if you lose their favorite one, they're very upset. But exactly. this is it's probably a toy that kids will play with on a regular yes. basis. And like you said, it's got a good message. The other good thing about these is they're really durable and there's no holes. So there's no way oh. that water or drool mm -hmm. or anything can get in there and, and, and make, make it yucky. Yucky. gross stuff inside. My oldest yeah. son would play with that all the time. Yeah. And he's 28. Well, <laughs> but I'm not we can kidding. talk he about would, that he later. He would still play with that. <laughs> I'm not kidding. He'd sit and play with it. Okay, you've got one more thing. So this this is the Mighty Microbes Lab and Germ Journal, which I think is the coolest idea. I never mm -hmm. had a science kit as a kid. Did you ever? You know, they had those oh, chemistry sure. things yeah. as a yeah. chemistry set. Well, it's no, kind of no. like that. It comes with the petri dishes and all of the lab equipment for kids. And then one of the cool experiments you can do is test your own toothbrush and actually oh. see the bacteria oh. that's on your toothbrush. Like and so scene. this morning I said to Avery, um, do you want to do this experiment and see all the germs on your toothbrush? And she said, that's disgusting. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. This might be good for adults, too. There you go. I'm excited about That's it. Cool. You might throw away your toothbrush. Yes. We are going to post a link to Emily's blog on kclive.tv. That'll come up later today. Thank you so much for bringing all the goodies. Thank you for having this me. This is Wonderful. fantastic, and I'm going to buy this right now. All right.